Welcome to Chester Ridge High School virtual tour. I'm Eric Znansky, the high school principal. Uh, today, you're gonna meet my assistant principal, Greg Lazar, and a, a few high school seniors who are gonna show you where the classrooms are. I'm starting outside of our cafeteria where you'll be coming into school from the bus or parent pickup, and we'll go down the hallway. On the right, we have our cafeteria where we'll be eating during fifth period. Uh, we will have the desk labeled where students can be sitting, plus we will be utilizing the stage with additional seats. We have our nurses station here on the right, Mrs. Barkman, high school nurse available all day. And if you're feeling any symptoms, you know, please come and check in with her. Okay, as we move down the hallway, we will introduce you to our new assistant principal, Mr. Lazar. Hello, my name is Mr. Lazar. I'm the assistant principal here at Chestnut Ridge. Uh, first thing I'd like to show you is our library is located right out front of our office here. There's some study halls located in here and it's a great place for resources. Around the corner to our front doors is our offices. So if you have a question pertaining to the school or you need me or Mr. Sithnansky, please come in here. We'll help you as soon as we can and uh, try to help you with all your needs. Our athletic wing begins over here. We have two bathrooms here right outside our gym. Boys and girls, our athletic trainer is located right here in the corner of our gymnasium. Our gymnasium is found right outside our office where our sporting events and practices are held. Our wrestling room is at the end of the gymnasium and we have the emergency exit doors on the other side. Going to the other hallway, some of our meetings that we'll be having that we need to space out will be located in here along with our breakfast, I'm sorry, our non-breakfast students that come early in the morning. You'll be staged in here before school, so bring something to entertain yourself because social distancing will still be uh, used in the morning here. In this hallway, at the very end, we have Mr. Mountain, our new band director. And then we have our girls and boys locker rooms located along this wall, along with our weight room in the middle. Uh, one note to our athletes, make sure that you are taking all your athletic gear home on a daily basis. We're not leaving it here, so you can take it home, clean it, sanitize it, and we'll keep our uh, locker rooms in a much cleaner state this year. And here we have Isabel Wingard, senior at Chestnut Ridge High School. Hello. So here to my left, we are going to start here with Mr. Herman, and he is our 12th grade special ed teacher. And then right across from him, we have Ms. Romano. And this is her health classroom, but she is also one of our gym teachers as well. And if we go down the hallway a little bit, these are the double doors that you'll see. If you go through the double doors, right here we have Mr. Brubaker, and he is our... Spanish teacher, and then if you look right across, we have the stairs that lead downstairs into mostly our eighth grade hallway. And then if you go down here a little bit, you have Mrs. Wozniak, and she is our ninth grade special ed teacher. Her classroom actually got moved. It was down that hallway a little bit, but it's actually moved here now. And then going down a little bit farther, right beside her, we have Mrs. Boyce, and she is a math teacher, one of our math teachers. And then going down a little bit more, right here we have Mrs. Bowser's room, and she is our social studies and driver's ed teacher. However, the first half of the year we will have Mr. Grubb in here as our main substitute just for the first half of the year. And then right beside her we have Mrs. McDonald, and she is our 10th grade English teacher. And she's also our FBLA director. Most people who are in FBLA. And then down here we have Mrs. Tantorno, and her classroom also got moved. It was down there where Mrs. Wozniak was, or is now. And she is our, one of our social studies teachers. And then we have Mr. Oldham right here beside her, and he is our science teacher, one of our science teachers as well. And then we have Mrs. Simmons' room, and she is also our ninth grade social studies teacher. And then going 
going through these double doors. We have Mrs. Herman right here on this side, and she is one of our science teachers in biology. And then on this side, we have Mr. Fry, and he is also another one of our science teachers. And then if you're going to go back through these double doors, you can take these stairs downstairs into our eighth grade hall as well. And here we have Dom Clark Sr. at Chestnut Ridge High School. All right, so once you come through these doors, you'll see that you have Mr. Emmerich as your ag teacher. And this is where students come from student parking lot. Right here, we have a new teacher. His name is Mr. McVicker. He's your te tech ed teacher. And if we come down here, you have your eighth grade social studies teacher, Mr. Rocco. And then you have Mr. Pliego doing TV production. Right here is Mr. Lazier. He's the eighth grade uh, language arts teacher. And then right here, you'll have your uh, eighth grade reading teacher, Mrs. Lamb, and your eighth grade guidance counselor, <laughs> Mrs. Clark's over there. And then we also have a new teacher. His name is Mr. Baron Barano. He's the eighth, ninth grade English teacher. And then we have Mr. Boland, which is the eighth grade special ed teacher. And then right down here is uh, Mrs. Wagner with the chorus room. And here we have Grace Ziegler, senior Chestnut Ridge High School. Right here is where the elevator is to go upstairs. We have to ask for a key off the adjacent classroom teachers. And on this side is where Mrs. Flegel teaches, and she's a math teacher. And then right beside her is where Mrs. Wissinger is, and she's a math teacher also. This way, over this hall, is where the bathrooms are, and then you have all the water stations to fill up your water bottles. And then go this way. Right here is Mr. Flegel's room and he's the tech teacher. And then if you go down the hall even more, right here is Mrs. Lisa's room and she's the art teacher. And she puts all kinds of beautiful artwork up on the bulletins. And through this hall even more, there's a double door. is the woodshop with Mr. Emmerich and Mr. McVicker. And then this way is where the tennis courts are. And here we have high school senior Alex Rizzo. Through these doorways, room over here is Mrs. Glass's room. She's a learning support teacher. Then on this side, we have the new science teacher, Professor Unknown. They're so good, they haven't even been hired yet. On this side, we have Mr. Wicker. He's a science teacher. Over here, we have Mrs. Ben. She teaches social studies, such as American government for 11th graders. Right here we have Mr. Cooper. He's an 11th grade English teacher. Right here we have Ms. Divert. She's a math teacher. Right here we have Ms. Tibbet. She's a special education teacher. Over this way we have the bathrooms and the water stations for the upper hallways. Now to my left we have Mrs. Seidlinger. She's another great math teacher. Right here is another entrance to the elevator. In order to get a key, you need to ask the adjacent teachers. Right here is Miss Debsky's room. She teaches ESL, or English Second Language. 
Down here we have one of the computer labs. This one is run by Mr. Morbidson. Right here is the 12th grade English teacher. Her name is Mrs. Walter. Here we have our second computer lab. This one is run by Mrs. Oldham. And right here we have another entrance to the library. Remember, we are wearing our masks unless we can social distance more than six feet apart.